This is the public toilet at Eriku in Ley. There are three other businesses operating on the property. These include a hair saloon, clinic and a food bar. They were ordered to close by the Ley City Council last week for operating without trading licenses. The property owner Luke Yawao said the businesses have paid the legal fees last year to Ley City Council but weren't given a license to operate. I refuse to tell them to close the doors because legally they have already paid their fees. It is the fault of city council officers. I don't know for some unknown reasons they refuse to issue them the trading licenses. Maybe one major reason I know they refuse to give them the, the trading licenses is because I have been getting into uh, problems with city council of the land in which public toilet is standing on. The 24-hour closure notice was given to these shops last week Tuesday following a meeting between the Lay City Council Health Division and the landlord. According to the director for Lay City Council Health Division, Jonathan Ipang, they have received reports from the public that the food bar was selling overdue food. We have uh, received the complaints at the Eriku uh, food bar of uh, that particular food bar selling the um, overdue food. When we are looking at Maskap, we are talking to Mr. Salim just like okay, okay. You must come talking, Mister. Take him. Just like okay, must come give me a talk. Just like okay, okay, okay. You them. Now you Salim get all customers. So I'm picking the blame. It's a breakfast in Chile. Just like I buy now to go to school. Now me plus two are having breakfast in Chile. Now me plus one of them can take out to cook him. I told the officers which did us here. I said no. This is illegal. You can close this place down. Even to that point, I also followed them up two times after the city council office to talk to the director, health and community services. His name is is. Uh, 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 Jonathan Ipang, Jonathan Ipang, and I told him also the manager responsible for all the public uh, toilets and public amenities like this. His name is Godfrey Warrior. I said no, I will not allow them to close the doors because I have no legal right because they can turn around and sue me for loss of business. So I have allowed them to continue to operate. Mr. Yawau obtained his land title from the Lands Department in Port Mosby in 2016. He is operating his business as Comfort Management Services Limited. The property owner has called on the Lay City to Council to do their job the properly and, and serve the interest of the public that Department includes in local Mosby. businesses. I have the copy of the title that I'm holding right now in front of you. This is legal tender. Okay? It's a title issued to me on the 16th of 8, 2016. Issued to me by the Register of Titles in his office in Waigani. I have followed all the necessary requirements to obtain this title. I have not gone under the table. I have not gone above the table. I have been, in actual fact, in broad daylight, conducted my duties to obtain this title through legal means. Julie Badui, OWA, National MTV News, Lay.